couple. Universal Coins Mike Fulgen is here to tell us about the hottest new coins on the market, and he's joined by Coach Tick Price. Thank you both so much for joining us. Thank well. you. All right, Coach Price, I have to ask you: Are you a coin guy? Yeah, I love coins, yeah. especially the. Uh, the kind that's rare. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you get a little bit more money with those rare coins. And of course, Mike has all the all of them, the rundown <laughs> of them. I always go to him whenever I have a question about coins. Now, first one, what is the hottest one on the market right now? Well, it's the Australian saltwater crocodile coin. Ooh. And for anybody who remembered Steve Irwin, the crocodile hunter uh -huh. who unfortunately passed away, that was yeah. his favorite reptile. It's the largest reptile. It kills over 250 humans a year. If you Google it, you can see some amazing shots of it coming out of the water to go after people in boats uh -huh. and going after elephants and everything else. Anyway, it's a popular animal for coins, and Australia is starting a coin with the saltwater crocodile. Okay, so, it, but it's just a crocodile. He's not coming out the water. No, he's yeah. coming out of the coin. <laughs> All right. Okay, and so, um, with this coin, about how much does it cost? Uh, it's about $2.5 to $3 over spot. Mm -hmm. So, if spot silver's $20, it's about $20. Three dollars. Okay, that's not too bad at all. Now, what's the latest news on that baseball coin that we were talking about that I fell in love with? Well, I have them here. They sold out at the U.S. Mint, and they now are making them in holders with Nolan Ryan facsimile signatures. A lot of baseball greats are signing the labels for these, so you'll see them around. But it's very popular. It's on our shop, on our website. Uh, with the designer Cassie McFarland, and next month I'll have Nolan Ryan facsimile signatures on the website. Wow, I have to say it is a not only a nice coin, but it's just a really good looking coin. It's the first ever curved coin by the U.S. Mint. Very popular, very cool. Friends of mine say coolest coin ever. And I was going to say, you know, for people looking for maybe something fun for Father's Day, that might be the perfect gift. Oh, it's wonderful. Just go to the shop online. You can buy it online. It'll be shipped within a day to you. All right. And so I understand that um, we have a winner in our midst for the Press Club Awards. Talk well, more about that. Congratulations to you all here, too. And <laughs> we were fortunate enough to win two first place, two third place at the Press Club Awards for our newsletter. People can get it free on the website and our mm -hmm. press releases. And so so check it out. But we're very fortunate of that. And the Beaumont Enterprise awarded us with the top gold seller of the year for the Beaumont Enterprise. So it's been a good week for us. It sure has. And speaking of good weeks, you also, you guys do so much in the community. You sponsor so many different people. Kind of talk about some of the upcoming events that you have. Well, we work with Reverend J.D. Roberts on a reading program for Save Our Children, as you see on the shirt. My wife's driven 14 years for Meals on Wheels. Mm -hmm. And we also work with Lamar. I've known Tick yeah. for over 25 years. Yeah. He has a basketball camp out there for kids, and we yeah. like to support kids in the community. And Tick's here for uh, representing as the new head coach of Lamar University. Yeah. Wow. Well, congratulations to that. And tell Thank us a little you. bit about the summer camp. Well, our basketball camp, uh, we've got two day camps, which is starts on June the 17th through the 20, 20th from 9 o'clock to 3 p.m. And then we have a second summer session, which is June 20 through the 24th. Mm -hmm. which also from 9 to 3 o'clock. Uh, we teach the proper fundamentals and technique of the game, sportsmanship. We give out T-shirts, basketballs, as well as certificates, and we give them free lunch. And, you know, one thing that I find about the different camps that go on is, you know, it is about basketball or football, but it's also about those life lessons for the, for the kids. Well, we have uh, lectures every day after lunch, and we teach the game of life as well. Uh, talk about proper uh, sportsmanship, the importance of getting your education, uh, the long hours of being a student athlete. But uh, Mike and I have known each other a long time. We have long running conversations about sports all the time. Yeah. And uh, he's a very knowledgeable guy, not about coins and rare coins as much as he's a great basketball mind. Well, thank you both so much for joining us. We appreciate it, and it sounds like a great week for everybody. Nicole, thanks for having me. Oh, absolutely. We'll be right back. You're watching Southeast Texas Live. We're going to do some more road tripping. <laughs>